What the? Hey, kid, you carrying any cash? No. Don't know what you sniffing. Don't say I didn't warn you. What the? So this is what we do now. Are you serious? Firmly grasp it. Yo, yo, yo. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to Wingate TV. I am here with Kindergarten. I'm looking for games that are popular. I mean, they're popular, but you know, they're kind of old. But I want to play those games because if they were so popular, I want to I want to check it out for myself. So here we go. Kindergarten play. File one. Monday. Cool. Yeah, that's how we usually start the school days. Alright, is this my room? Alright, alright. Looks like here we got a bunch of maybe cards to pick. Yeah. This is my bed. A little piggy bank. I can't see what kind of poster that is, but I'm assuming we're gonna have to take some money. You know what? I'm gonna just take all of it. Why not? I'm going to be a baller. Cool. Am I ready to start another day at kindergarten? Well, this is my first day. I don't know about another. Hmm. I smell money. Yeah, someone is definitely carrying more than $3 around here. I don't know who. It ain't me. What the? Hey, kid. You carrying any cash? No. Don't know what you sniffing. Don't lie to me. I know when I smell money. Give me half or else. Man, I am not no pushover. Look, kid, I don't have time to argue this with you. Give it to me or you're dead me. You know what? You only coming to me because you can't make your own money, but I'm going to tell you anyway. Go make it. Don't say I didn't warn you. What the? So this is what we do now. Are you serious? Firmly grasp it either bring less money to school or give half the bugs. So when he said he would really go on and kill me, he wasn't lying. Okay, let's try that again. I smell money. Yeah, I know. Y you know what? I'm not even going to argue with you. Yes. Yes. Yeah, I, I split your empty skull. Yep. I've already seen you do that, so I know you will. Good boy. Don't, I'm not no dog now. Don't go telling the teacher about this, or you might end up turning missing like that Billy kid. I don't know who Billy is or how he went missing, but you're lucky I can't fight. Alright, where should I start? You know what? This girl right here. But she looks like she's gonna be, I don't know, mean. Hey there, cutie. I'm Cindy. You wanna be my boy? Perfection. <laughs> I got girls already drooling over me. You know what? Let's do this. Yeah, that's what I like to hear. And we'll totally be the cutest couple in school. But first, you have to do something for me. What? Why do I have to do something for you? You came up to me saying, oh, I came up to you. But you all saying, do I want to be your boyfriend? So isn't our love enough? Haha, <laughs> that's cute. But no, it is. You're going to have to prove it to me. Well, I mean, I, I can see that. But how? You see that girl over there? That's Lily. She's by far the ugliest, nastiest girl you will ever meet. I want you to take this gum and stick it in her hair during morning time. Got it? No. I don't want to be rude, because what does she ever do to me? Or you? I feel like in this, I, I think in this game I have to do these type of missions to progress, so I'm going to do it. Oh yay, this is going to be so great. She'll finally get what she deserved, just like her brother did for dumping me. That's why you mad at her? Because her brother dumped you? That ain't got nothing to do with her, though. Come find me for morning time after you've done it. Yeah, what happened to her brother? You haven't heard? He went missing. His disappearance totally stole the thunder from my dog, Biscuit, going missing. So you're telling me you all, you're caring about a dog when a whole person went missing? I guess everyone just cares more about him than they do about me. What the? That's a whole person though. I mean a dog. I mean that's something to be worried about too. But a whole person? And you tell me that's more important? 
Should I should I be like that? Should I be like that? I care about you. Yeah, I'ma do that. Yep, that's why you're gonna stick that gum in Lizzie's hair during morning time. Come see me after you've done it. Alright. I can't well, you know what? Let me talk to her. Since I'm about to ruin her day. Let me just go see what she's about. Oh, um, hey, I'm Lily. She seems like one of the shy girls. You probably heard about what happened to my brother, Billy. Uh, I'm gonna just say I haven't just so she'll tell me something. You haven't? It's been all over the news. He went missing a few days ago. Mm-hmm, yeah, I am sorry to hear that. Thanks. That makes you one of the few people that even seem to care. Ever since he went missing, people either ignore me or insult me. Again, why? Sydney has been trying to put gum in my hair. Ooh, I can give it to her? Nah, that, that's, that's like, I'm pretty sure this has like multiple endings, so I'm gonna, that's gonna be another one. I don't know, but if I were you, I'd stay away from her. She's really mean. Yeah, thanks. But, I'm about to ruin your whole day. Who is this? He looked like a smart kid. I'm Monty. If you need something, come talk to me. Odds are I can get it for you for the right price. Oh, he's, so he's like a mole rat. You know, he he got all the stuff. He got the supplies. What I need and what I sell changes throughout the day, so come see me often. I, I don't want to buy anything right now because I don't think I have to. But I know I'm going to have to come to you at some point. I'm too long. I don't think you're cool enough to talk to me. The one black guy and he don't think I'm cool enough. You know what? Forget you, Jerome. Forget you. I forgot to talk to him all the way over here. Hi. My friends call me Nugget. Or they would if I had any. Nugget knows no love or friendship since Billy went missing. I know what happened to Billy, so I'm going to just say, I'll be your friend. What is your offering? Offering? I have to offer something to be your friend? You must offer something to prove your friendship to Nugget. Maybe that's why you don't have more friends. You, you make them offer something to be your friend. Perhaps, but Nugget does not make a move. Nugget only follows you. Now please present Nugget with your offering. Who makes these imaginary rules? Pritzel has made the rules for Nugget. Why? You ask too many questions. The principal question that Nugget gives this to anyone who is so curious. What is that? What is that? Nugget doesn't know. The principal is very mysterious. He said, also said not to talk to anyone who has it. Bye bye. Why did I let you give me this? Why? Whatever this is, I'm not liking the outcome of whatever happens to me when this thing pops off or whatever. How you doing there, Sonny? Don't mind the old janitor here. Just sweeping up after you silly cretins. Sweepy, sweepy, sweepy. That's a mop. Exactly. Not a freaking broom. Get your head straight, old man. Ah, so it is. You're also mopping a sidewalk, which doesn't need mopping because it's a freaking sidewalk, simpleton. I'll be mopping your blood off if you don't get that off. Yep, I'm going to leave because... Nah, I know that if they say something, they're pretty much going to do it. So, yep, not taking that chance. I'm Miss Applegate. I have been well endowed <clears throat> with ex excellent teaching qualities. I can tell her that Bug stole my money. Ooh. Should I? Should I? You know what? Since they give me the chance, I'll do it. He did? Interesting. I'll make you a deal. Bugs is a real troublemaker. He's violent and a danger to others. If you go over there and challenge him, I'll make it worth your while. Oh, not what if he hurts me. I know he's gonna hurt me. It'll build character. Yeah, is this even legal? Probably not. But if this is how I can start my underground kid fighting ring, then it's a risk I'm willing to take. What kind of teacher are you? What's in it for me? I'll give you a gold star. What? You think a gold star is worth my life? But I accidentally pushed it anyway. Yeah. Okay, fine. Whatever. If I even decide to do it, I don't have to do it. But you know what? Since I went that far, let's do it. 
What do you want, dweeb? I'm not giving you your money back. Get out of here before I squish you. Squish me will make your dad come back. My dad will come back. He just went to the store to get some cigarettes. It's all. Get out of here or I'll beat you so hard it'll make him proud. He'll never be proud of you, chump. Yes, he will. If you don't leave right now, I'll kill you. Yeah, I know you will, but let's just try. Let's do it. Fine, you act for it. This is for you, Dad. Uh, teacher, you should be looking out. I shouldn't have to call you. Bugs, how dare you attack another student unprovoked again? That's the last straw. I'm sending you to the principal's office so he can finally expel you. No, please don't. He started it. He's a liar. He said my dad was never coming back. Well, he's right. And after this little incident, neither are you. Now go to the principal office or I'll have the janitor carry you there. What? What? Go! Stupid rat. You could have been friends if you didn't rat me out. I think the yellow text is like an alternate decision. Oh, happy day. I'm finally rid of that little degenerate. Here's your gold star as promised. Thanks. Hmm, now that you got me thinking though, Jerome thinks he's so high and mighty because he's the principal's kid. Is that why he like just shoved me away like a few minutes ago because he's a principal's kid? Yes, we could arrange a trip for him to visit his dad. Well, that's what I like to hear. Come to me during morning time and I'll tell you what to do. I right, then. Okay, children, it's time to start the day. Everyone head inside for morning time. Good morning, children. It's time for you to pick your buddies for morning time. Or you can be sad, pathetic, and alone. As long as you're the best you, you can be. Well, she said she wanted to see me, so I want to see what she, what she has to say. Go find a morning buddy, or you'll be an outcast loser like Nugget. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Before I do that... Yo, Cindy. I forgot. You said... Well, what are you waiting for? Stick the gum in your hair. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot I had to do that. Lily? Oh, I don't really do the whole morning buddy thing anymore. My brother Billy was normally my buddy, but he's missing. You know what? Stick this freaking gum in your hair. I'm sorry. I I'm sorry. I had to do it. Did you just... Oh, you did. You put gum in my hair. That's so mean. Cindy put you up to this, did she? Well, I don't even care. Leave me alone. Now she's crying. Cindy, you're... You're the worst. Why did I even agree to do this? Anyway, back to... The teacher. Yeah. You wanted to see me about Jermo Jerome? Ah, yes. The high and mighty Jerome. Always talking back to me because his dad is my boss. I think it's time we finally got even with him. How? The principal has informed me that one of his hall passes has gone missing. I bet Nugget's life that Jerome took him. What? Why Nuggets? What is, why Nugget? Yeah, I would've asked that one. Not much, but I make a teacher's salary, so even by my student life value system is still a pretty significant percentage. Yeah, why don't you just, if you think he has it, why don't you just take it? I'm not allowed to search a student without probable cause, and Lord knows there's no probable cause for searching the pr principal's son. That's why I need him to give it to you. Okay. Just go over there and get him to give it to you. Well, he didn't like me like two seconds ago, so I don't know if he'd be willing to give me it. Dude. You know you're not cool enough to talk to me, let alone be my morning buddy. Besides, Monty is gonna hook you up with a sweet yo-yo. Did you steal a hall pass, dude? Why? You interested in getting one? Yeah, I am. Well, too bad. I'm not interested in helping a dweeb like you. Oh, why not? I want to be cool. Look, man, unless there's something cool in there for me, you can forget it. Now get lost. You know what? Since he keep talking about yo-yos, I'm gonna see if Monty has something. Wanna be my morning buddy? I ain't got time for that nonsense. So unless you're buying or selling something, get lost. Do you sell yo-yos, my dude? He does. Let me get one. Let me get one. Yeah, I don't need anything else from you. Alright. Here you go, Jerome. 
I told you already, I'm not interested in getting your hall pass unless there's something cool in it for me. Yeah, I got something cool. A yo-yo. Heck yeah, they are cool. Maybe you are, after all. I'll trade you this for the past. We've got a deal, and since we're going to be friends, I think you should do something to help me out. You know, as a friend. Yeah, what, what you got? You know that crypto janitor? He stole my laser pointer this morning. Said he was too bright and shiny for his old eyes. I need your help to get it back. What do you want me to do? When you're ready, I'll give you a hall pass. You can use a dip by the hall monitor. Once you're past him, head to the janitor's closet. My laser should be in there somewhere. I want to ask that, but since he's asking me, I guess he can't do it for some reason. Awesome. Should be in a box somewhere. Just grab it and go. Don't linger there too long. He checks back frequently. Alright. Let me know when you're ready and I'll give you the hall pass. I won't be able to strap the teacher for long, so head straight for the door. Don't talk to anyone on your way out. Wait a second. She wants to remove Jerome. And if I do this, that's not removing him. You know what? I knew this game had like multiple things to do. So, I'm Jerome, I'm sorry. I have to get you on this one. Well, did you get... Oh, wait. Did I get... I didn't get the hall pass. There you go. Now it's the hall pass. Now, if he's distracting her, can I still talk to her? Give me a minute. Jerome is distracting me. Oh, here we go. I got the pass. I knew it. Jerome, you little cockroach. You've been over this. You can't just steal your dad's hall passes. What? You ran me out to the teacher? Dude! Yes, he did. He's a good little rat. Hey, yo, don't be, don't be disrespecting me now. I'm helping you out. I'm helping you. Please stop calling me that. No, because that's what you are. Teacher special little rat. Just like Jerome is teacher special little suspended hooligan. Aw, oh, come on, bro. I thought you were cool. Well, he's not. And because he's so uncool, he gets one of my special gold stars again. Now, why don't you go take that pass back to your dad? I'm sure he'd love to know where it went. Man, stupid rat. Getting me in trouble. My dad is going to kill me. Yeah, he actually probably is. I have no doubt in that. Oh, that was just perfect. You're a natural as this. Let's keep this kid removal train going. All right. I have a special plan for Nugget. Just befriend a little weirdo by the time recess starts. Feel free to get any other kids in trouble while you're in there. You'll have to get creative, though. Now I gotta get everybody out of here? Well, Nugget... I'm gonna see if he's the best thing to do right now. Nugget does not wish to spend morning time with you. Nugget is very busy. Yeah, do you want to be friends? Oh. Nugget normally spends morning time alone, eats lunch alone, and lives life alone. Nugget's supposed to could be your friend if... If what? Spill it. You eat this nugget. Dang. Uh, I don't know. That nugget look a little suspicious. Yes, do this for nugget and we will be friends. Well, if this means I'll be his friend and then, you know, kill him afterwards, <laughs> I guess we'll do it. Good. I remember the taste of the nugget. We will dine together at lunch. Nugget will see you then. Alright. Okay, kids, that's the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for a nutritious meal. I hear we're having slop today. That's not very exciting, actually. That sounds terrible. Okay. Wait. I saw something down at the bottom. Darn it! Ah, oh, crap. Did you do it? Oh my gosh, you totally did. Wow, what happened? Did she... What did she say? Did she cry? I bet she cried. She cried. Sick human being. Yes, I'm so happy. Now you can be my morning buddy, which also makes you my boyfriend. As my boyfriend, you get the honor of playing house with me. Oh, okay. Um, before that, before we do that, you need to get cleaned up. No way any boyfriend of mine is going to bleed all over me. Go to the bathroom and get washed up. I'll be over by the dollhouse. You know what? I might just have to skip all that then. The, what is it? Hello? Can you back up? Can you like get away from me? Not so fast there, little dude. I'm gonna need to see your hall pass before I can let you by. I have a pass, yeah. Get away from me. Dang. And he's still over there, still trying to follow me. 
I'm not even gonna ask what's going on around here. Welcome home, husband. I hope work wasn't too hard, because you're gonna be making dinner. What? I'm at work, and you're telling me I gotta make dinner? Yeah, why? Because I've been so busy maintaining the house, and I... Have you been drinking again? What? Don't you play down with me, mister. Have you been drinking? You know what? I'm gonna just play along and say yes. Well, at least you're being honest with me, and most importantly, yourself. Yourself. You have a problem. Yeah, I don't have a problem, but like I said, I'm playing along with this. I want you to call your sponsor and tell him all about it. I also want you to give me money to buy a new purse to help end the trauma in the PSD. Ooh, girl! You know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm so glad you care so much about me. Thank you, sweetie. We'll get through this together. Now go make my dick. You freaking... That was the most fun I had playing house in a while. You're gonna make a splendid boyfriend. I want you to have lunch with me. Alright. Great, I'll see you then. Which is right now. Oh, hey, boyfriend. I saved you a spot. Go get something to eat and come sit with me. Alright. I guess I'll get some slop. How you doing there, sonny? Yeah, give me some. Don't be shy, but come back for seconds. Yeah, because it's probably just... It's ill, it's stupid, and weird to give somebody slop. Yeah, I do have something to eat. Oh good, I was just thinking about... Oh darn it, my stupid mother packed me something that's not vegan. You know what vegan is in kindergarten? She knows I'm all vegan right now. That woman is ins ins insufferable. Hey sweetie, would you get me a darling and get me something vegan? Yeah, you know... I'm like, I don't exactly know what that means. How do you know what, how do you know that you're a vegan if you don't know what it even means? You know what? I know exactly what to get you. Yeah, how much are they? Just get to the point. Yeah, let's see what she says about this. What did you get me? This. That's vegan? Are you sure? Yes. I'm very sure. Nope. Not really. Um, okay. I trust you. Hey, that's pretty good. It kind of reminds me of my dog in a weird way. Mm-hmm. I bet it does, huh? Thank you so much for getting this for me. Yeah, no problem, babe. You're being so good to me today. You're probably the most well-trained boy I've ever met. I should use you for something at recess. Hmm, I have an idea. What's that? I'm really liking the way Lily wears that gum. But maybe we can put something else in there. Yeah, what do you mean, something else? Drone was telling me how the janitor has all sorts of gross stuff in the closet. I'm thinking we find something to get to Lily. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he keeps it locked. Oh, don't you have to worry about that. Look what I have. Yep, a girl has her ways. I'm gonna head over there and pay up the lunch lady so you can get going down into that nasty closet. Yeah, I don't have time for that. I don't have time for that. I literally can't do it. Exactly, I'm not, I can't do it. Cindy, I, I'm sorry to break this to you, but I ain't got nothing. You didn't grab anything? What are you even good for? Wow. That's how you feel? That's really how you feel. Wow. You know what? It's not my fault. I'm over here running around for everybody. Dang. I guess I'll just finish the day. That's the bell. Let's all head back inside for show and tell. Hope everyone has good recess. Let's all get ready. Why don't you go first? Uh, let me show the gold stars. It looks like I'm being a kiss ass. Oh, you just love being my little rat, don't you? Showing off your gold star to the rest of these imbeciles. 
That's very good. Thank you for sharing. It's gonna be hard to beat that. But anybody else got nothing, I'm pretty sure. Or maybe they did. Maybe that was in their cupboards. Oh, that's the bell. Hope you had a fun day. I'll see you all tomorrow. Alright, now we got through one day. Oh, oh, if I could rap, I'd, I'd rap to this, but I can't. No, sir. No, let me stop. I can't do it. Monday again. Why is it Monday again? I don't understand that. We didn't get no cards. We didn't get no cards. I think that's what those are. All right, y'all. I'm ending right here. We completed a day at least, but of course there are going to be more gameplays of this, so I'm going to figure out how to do all these missions and stuff. If y'all enjoyed this, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one. I'm out. Peace.